Today I'm going to show you a illustrated image of cystic lung diseases which are uh, commonly encountered and I try to uh, illustrate with the, their classic features and classic location and their appearance as well. So let us see the first one that is the lamb lymphangiomyomatosis that is lamb which is commonly seen in females associated with tuberous sclerosis and these are the cysts in this lamb are diffuse bilateral and almost of similar size even though not the exact size almost of similar size and they are usually thin walled more than 10 in number and these cysts do not contain any septa within the within them so this is the classic feature of the lamb coming to the lip that is the lymphocytic interstitial pneumonitis in this case you see few cysts which are less in number and again they are thin walled and you can see some amount of background chrome glass opacities in case of LIP and sometimes ill-defined nodules might be present. So these are the features of LIP. And coming to Bithog Dube syndrome, uh, the cysts in this uh, syndrome are classic in the lung. That is, they are usually the paramediastinal in location or subplural in location if you go to the periphery. And they are thin walled and the shape is actually like a lentiform shape. It's not like a classic round well-defined kind of cystic appearance and and one more important point is the lower lung zone predominance so these are the classic features which are, will indicate you or will give a hint that we need to rule out a big hog tube syndrome coming to the the last one that is the which is another important thing that is the pulmonary langerhans cell histiocytosis in this we see again uh, many cysts which are usually bizarre in shape sometimes bilobed is lower leaf shaped or it, various names uh, have been given for based on the appearance of the cysts in pulmonary LCH and the, these usually have the upper and mid zone predominance and another important thing is the sparing of the CP angles if you see the CP angles they are characteristically spared in pulmonary LCH and sometimes you might see ill-defined nodules in the upper lobes in case of pulmonary LCH so these are the classic features of common cystic lung diseases with syndromic kind of manifestations and these location of this is uh, characteristic feature of this is with background lung changes always give a clue for us uh, to direct in the diagnosis thank you very much for watching